YouTube and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, hi, my name is Kiara and this is my channel, Hey Key. Um, if you are a current subscriber, hey you guys, thank you for clicking on yet another one of my freaking videos. I truly do appreciate you, so thank you. Now, so as you can see on the title of this video, we are talking about birth control. Depo. The Depo shot, the Depo Vera, the shot, whatever you want to call it. So if you are interested in finding out my experience with Depo and just the overall stuff about the Depo shot, keep watching this video. I don't even know how to start this video. Like honestly and truly, I've been on just about every birth control method out there except two. But literally I've been on every method except two because I was just like, you know what? I don't want those. I don't care. I don't, I just don't care. I don't want it. So. I was on, I got on Depo like two, almost three years ago. And I got on that right after I finished my um, next Nexplanon. The next Nexplanon is like that little rod that goes in your arm. Like they numb your arm and then they just inject like this little rod thing and it's good for like three four years I don't remember three four years five years I don't know that method tried to take me out like that method tried to kill me like that method was trying to ruin my life okay anyway so depo I've been on depo for like two 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 three years right so I got on it because I was like you know what after experiencing the next penine I just want something that's very effective but I don't want anything that's so invasive so it's like if I ever decide to get off I can just skip my next shot and let the stuff wear off and I'll be good so I'm like okay cool let's do the depo you know so I get the shot I get it and I was like um my weight was I was I've always been a very thin girl like very thin very small slim temp well, not trim temp slim and trim there we go so I've always been that you know slim trim you know nah, never had to worry about weight belly fat weight gain chafing chafing is so new to me now I understand people's pain chafing hurts never had these problems you know I was nice and slim and trim um so when you get the depot they do tell you a few things you know it does weaken your bone density um what else what else it weakens your bone density you stop getting periods what else what else um it does increase your appetite remember that it increases your appetite which leads to weight gain cool 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 um one of the doctors that i had actually told me that um women with a higher bmi tend to gain more weight versus slim women so i always kept that in the back of my mind like i'm slim and trim i'm cool you know i'm slim and trim i'm good you know just be mindful of if, I, if i'm hungry go eat a carrot or something you know that's what i had in my mind cool so fast forward i've been on this shot for like two two three years and it's very effective it's it's a great method very effective you don't think about it until like every 12 to 14 weeks when you get your next shot you can get your shot in your arm you can get it in your butt well not like on your butt like more so like your hip area like your side like if you just put your arm down this right here you can get you can get it right there so you get your shot every 12 to 14 weeks blase blase you good um with depo you do got to be mindful that it does weaken your bone density so you are highly encouraged to boost up on your calcium so if you like to drink milk just drink an extra glass of milk if you like your cheese just double up on your cheese take a supplement whatever just make sure you're getting your calcium in because it does weaken your de your bone density you don't want to get into a fight bam 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 and then somebody knock you out cold and you fracture you don't want that so oh and by the way i am not a doctor I'm just talking about my experience. I'm just talking about my experience and what I've learned over the years. I'm not a doctor. Anyway, so yeah, Depo, highly effective, great method. I do, eh, I would say I recommend it. I mean, it's cool. I recommend trying it. There you go. It's very cool, very effective. Um, very effective. Um, you don't get periods, so that's awesome. If I mean, if you like periods, cool, kudos to you. But if you don't like, if you want to get rid of them, great. You save some money. You save so much money, like on pants, tampons, um, all that stuff. You just, you don't, you just save your money. Like I feel like with Depo, like I would get a period like every once in a while, and those it was intense. Like the bleeding was intense. I like, blood clots. Oh my god um the cramps the cramps felt like i've never experienced cramps in my life like i felt like everything was intense with the devil like very very painful um what else i did notice i guess we're getting to the side effects now right yeah yeah so 
very very effective method very very effective method but the side effects is the reason why i decided to end that method just to end that like i just wanted to stop so if the, the your periods are your cramps are extreme like the cramps hurt I, i've never experienced cramps like that before um what else um i noticed that my hair was actually shedding a lot more and i was trying to test it out trying to see like am i really not taking care of my hair is it the products like what is it but nothing really changed i did do some digging and hair loss or shedding whatever can be a side effect of depo and i'm very convinced that it was the depo because my hair doesn't shed like that anymore and i talked to my doctors about it and they were like oh it's very rare i don't think that would be yeah whatever it was a depo so yeah the cramps was intense my hair was shedding and what else the irregular bleeding like i really didn't have bleeding but when i did the stuff was just annoying like you have like this this like this discharge that comes out we're all we're all women right we're watching it. if you made it this far you know what discharge is so it's not like the normal discharge it's like this brown thick discharge that just comes out it just comes out just come it it's so freaking annoying and it's like you don't feel it you really don't know you just look down and you're like oh my god here we go so you have to keep panty liners on you and um for the most part i would experience that like towards the end of each shot like when it's time for me to get my next shot like say like around 10 <clears throat> excuse me say like around 10 to 12 weeks from my last shot i would start getting like this this thick brown discharge and that's really like your body's way of letting you know it's time to get your next shot that's what i was told by my doctor like oh yeah it's just time to get your next shot that's normal but it's annoying like if it literally come like one two days before i'm due cool but no it would like come like two weeks before i was due for my shot so and then i would just be this brown discharge just be coming out until it was time for my next shot so it's like two weeks i'm going i'm just going through this and and then the thing about it with depot the earliest you can get your shot is 10 weeks so say i'm i'm eight weeks i'm literally just having this discharge come out for like the next two weeks and then i just have to wait it out until it's time to get my shot like i don't know the reason why you can't get your shot before 10 weeks i don't know i've asked i still don't have an answer to so i can't even tell you guys i don't know but you can't do it so you really just have to wait it out that that was that was that was an issue for me and i, I hated that and last but not least the weight gain so i don't know if any of you guys are following me on tiktok but i posted a video on tiktok here's the video and i got like such a great response from that that actually inspired this video for today so the weight gain like remember in the beginning of this video i told you guys that they tell you that depo increases your appetite and then i was also told that women with higher bmis tend to pick up weight versus women with with normal bmis right that was me slim and trim right when i started depo i was 142 pounds let me just say that I've gained over 20 pounds since I've been on depot. I'm not going to give you the exact amount because I'm over it. But yeah, I've gained over 20 pounds since I've been on it. And I've done my research. Like the average weight gain within like a year or so, 8 to, eight to 10 maybe. But you know, I've been slim and trim all my life. So I've never gained such a, a large lump sum of weight. That was the final straw for me with the depot. Like you got the intense cramps, you got my hair just, my hair just falling out. Like I'm like, what is going on? Hair falling out, the cramps, the discharge. And then you tell me I gained over 20 pounds? <laughs> I, you know what? I don't want this video to turn into a rant because this is not what that's about. This video was just to share my experience, let you guys know what I went through with the depo shot. And I, I did gain a lot of weight. So you were like slim built like me, um i just wanted to put that out there just to share this info with you guys yeah i've gained over 20 pounds since i was on depo and i am proud to say that i am no longer continuing that method i'm in the process of figuring out yeah what is that 
yeah i'm in the process of trying to figure out what i want next do i need a break i don't know um like i've told you guys earlier i've been on every method almost every method except two so i'm really trying to think should i give myself a quick break what do i do i don't know if you are interested in learning about all of the other methods and you want like a full breakdown a full story time let me know in the comments below and i'll give that out to you guys or i'll, I'll put that out for you guys but yeah that is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you made it this far Please subscribe to my channel if you didn't already. What are you doing? Let's subscribe and let's just keep it going. Go ahead and watch some of my other videos. Thank you guys for watching. Do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up and do not forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thank you guys for watching and I will catch you guys on the next freaking video.